Mike Plyaconis at the second annual Gear Jammer Magazine Truck Show. Mike, show us some of your trucks you brought today. Okay, the first truck we brought here is our 2000 W900 550 Cat. Okay. This bad boy right here is the pride of our fleet. Wow. It was our first show truck we ever had. Yeah. It's, it's been redone since the first time we showed it with new custom paint, chrome, everything. Wow, this is very impressive. What's, what's it good under the hood? It's got a 550 cat underneath it oh, right wow. now. We're gonna pop the hood right now, actually. All right, let's do it. Look at that, huh? This is when they actually built trucks to last on the highway. Not the new trucks they built today. That's right. Old school all the way, huh? Old school. 550 cat, you can't beat this engine. It was the best engine ever made, in my opinion. No e-log. And no e-log, too. That's right. Wow, that is amazing. Open up the door over here. Yeah, let's see the inside. Oh my god, that is incredible. We got custom stereo system, we have cameras that angle on the side of the truck so you can see all angles of the back of the truck as you're driving down the highway. No kidding. This is very impressive. Seven and a half inch snacks. Wow, but she sounds good, huh? Well, she sounds real good, especially when that jig brake starts kicking in. <laughs> Man. That is, wow. Look at that. That's an engine, dude. That is an engine right there. Holy cow. The right color and everything. Exactly. Wow. And then at night, when the light LED lights are kicked on in here, yeah. it's even brighter and nicer. I bet, huh? I bet she turns a lot of heads. She does. She does. This is by far my favorite truck of the whole fleet. That really? We yes. This was our very first show truck we ever had, we ever built, and it's always been my favorite. Wow. It's got a special place in my heart. It was dedicated yeah. to my grandfather. You know, who started. Is that started him on the back day. of the sleeper? Yes. Let me check it out. He's the founder of this company. He started yeah. this whole thing. And now it's my job and the future generation's job to keep this thing running. I'm sure I'd be proud of you. I mean, you guys are putting on a quite a display here today. Yeah. What else do you bring with you? Then we brought the big boy. Black edition. And who drives this? This is Errol's truck. Okay. This is a three, what is it, 387, 144 inch bunk ARI sleeper. Wow. All the comforts at home. Yep, pretty much. You got the shower, the toilet, everything in this no thing. No kidding. And the kitchen sink. Can, how long is a sleeper, do you know? 144 inch. 144 inch, you said that, okay. Wow, I like those boxes. Man. What a beautiful truck. And you guys haul cars for customers or? We haul cars for customers, we haul cars for showrooms, we haul cars for pretty much anybody. Okay. We do all the shows, we do all the exhibits, everything. Okay, wow. Now who's this guy over here? This guy right here, this is Mr. Shine right here, Dave Claycomb. Dave, say hello to the fans over here. Hey, Mr. Shine, nice to meet you. Yeah, I know. Why do they call you Mr. Shine? Well, it's obvious, I think. <laughs> I hand wax my truck and train. You wash too. your truck? Has yeah. it ever been washed? Wow, this is amazing. I stopped just to wax it. <laughs> and I, I don't wipe see, it down every stop. I don't see any fingerprints on it. <laughs> no fingerprints. Wow. <laughs> what year is this truck? 19. Wow. Beautiful. You must love it, huh? I love it. If I don't get a thumbs up or a picture taken when I go in somewhere, I'm upset. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's awesome, man. You got you. You guys show people cars inside the trailer right now. Too. Yeah, let's yeah. check it out. Yeah. yeah. Nice home built fenders. Yeah. So we have four Aston Martins here right now. Four Aston Martins. Yep, they're going to a dealership in Connecticut right now. Wow. No kidding, huh? Wow. Got one on the rear deck. Yeah, I see that. Jeez. The 
blue on this is just awesome. Wow, look at that, huh? That's four hundred thousand dollars just dangling on the back no of the trailer right now. Yeah. No way. Wow. <laughs> oh man. I got two millions in cars almost in this thing right now. No kidding. Damn. And what's this truck right here? So this is the retro truck. This is a flashback to the beginning of times. This was our original paint scheme right here, back in the beginning, 1982 okay. right here. Oh yeah. This uh, this has a lot of history to it, a lot of meaning behind it. This is when we first started, and it's humble beginnings. It's just paying tribute to where we started and where we are today. Wow. Very impressive. What year is this truck? This is a 2015 W900 with a 108-inch ARI bunk. Oh my God, Mike. Oh my God. You know, I've seen this going down the road and in pictures. It's, it's in person. It's just you got to see it in person. You yeah. got to see these. These trucks are amazing. They're like they're all like mat mat meticulous, perfect. Man, look at the stacks on that. It's a, it's a definitely a big change from where we started. I mean, we started in trucks where basically the, the seats of the trucks, we, we didn't have seats. Yeah. We sat on milk cartons. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we started with trucks that did not look this beautiful, this nice. I mean, this was, it's, it's, this, it's, like I said, it's, we've come a long way to where we're at today to have such beautiful equipment. And we take pride in our equipment, as you can see. This, yeah. All of our trucks look yeah, just as beautiful. Yeah. All of our other company trucks, everything. And you must be so proud of your family name and your company. And I am, I am, because, you know, like I said, family is everything to me. And trucking has provided a beautiful life for myself and yeah. not my future family. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. How was it finding drivers? These days, yeah. it ain't easy. Not easy finding good drivers, but huh? when they see the equipment that they can drive if they come to work here, Yeah. they all come. Yeah, I bet. I bet there's a line of applications. Uh, there is. Yeah. There is. But we only want the best because to be here, you're going to be driving equipment like this. Yeah, yeah. We want the best to drive it. Right, right. We want guys like Dave and Errol to take care of the equipment. Yeah. I'm back here at all times. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Well, I appreciate you talking to me. No, well, thank you. It's awesome. Man, what a... What a show. Look at the headlights on this thing. Holy cow. Let's pop this thing back down. Yeah. Wow. Elizabeth that, uh, Truck Center custom built this hood for us. Yeah. That is amazing, dude. All right, dude. Thanks a lot for talking to me, thank making a video. Much. I yeah. appreciate it. Yeah, thanks for coming out. Oh, thank you. All right.